Hi and welcome to this video. Uh, my name is Nemanja and today we'll be talking about HTTP live streaming uh, or better called HLS and uh, I wanted to share a little bit more information uh, on how you can get started as soon as possible and start protecting your videos uh, from being downloaded uh, online through uh, simple browser plugins and uh, give you ability to protect your content. So the service <laughs> that I'm coming from and that I will be talking to you about today is called Publitio. Uh, you can check the website at publi.io. And the idea of the service is uh, we basically built a video hosting service uh, that provides full APIs uh, for you to host, transcode and deliver your video content. Uh, and of course, uh, we have built a security features uh, to enable you to protect your videos from being downloaded. Now, I have to say one thing, uh, videos that are online, uh, there is always a way to find uh, a person to find a way to download them or they can uh, basically record the screen or they can record with the phone the screen. So the uh, thing that anyone else can offer online is like 99% uh, secure uh, and it prevents easy way for people to get access to the content. Uh, now. Uh, you can go to publi.io and create an account and inside of the account you have a dashboard where you can see what is your usage and uh, bandwidth used uh, inside of the account. But uh, what I wanted to focus on is uh, how easy it is to have a video converted into the HLS by Publitio. So I wanted to share uh, simple steps. So what you need to do is upload the video uh, and let's use Publitio test video. Uh, and all the all, only thing that you need to do is to enable HLS video encryption. And if you want to increase the security, uh, you can disable allow URL transformations. Uh, this means we won't uh, create additional formats uh, of MP4 file uh, that could be accessed uh, by other users. Uh, so let's click start upload. And the video is going to be uploaded within a few seconds. Uh, and uh, what I want to uh, note is that video conversion can take uh, from, I don't know, a few seconds, depending on the video size, uh, up to maybe, I don't know, even might uh, be an hour uh, if the video is over 60 minutes long. So as you can see right in here, I'm seeing like zero versions because I just uploaded the file. But when I refresh, I'll immediately see that there are some versions. So we can see three versions in here currently. And we scroll down, we can see that uh, we have created three versions. Uh, first is with 1280, which is uh, basically a thumbnail of this file. So when I open it, you can see this is a thumbnail uh, for the video. Uh, and we scroll down, you can see in here, this is the thumbnail. Uh, we can see additionally uh, CFIL H200 with 300. This is a mini thumbnail uh, for the preview of the file. So when I go back, this is basically uh, that file. And when I scroll down, you, I can see additionally Publitio created Publitio test video slash PM3U8. This is your HLS, HLS video. Now what Publitio does, it automatically generates multiple formats for a video. Uh, 1080, 720, uh, 480 and 360p. And when I click play, I can see the video playing. And on the right side, I can see that it's uh, selected as auto. Uh, it means it will stream the best quality based on internet connection of the user. So it tracks bitrate uh, of the user. And you can see additional formats where, for example, I can switch for 360p uh, and the video will continue streaming lower quality. Uh, now, this is uh, extremely important if a uh, user has a bad internet connection or starts losing connection, we'll automatically switch him uh, into lower quality uh, streaming. And if you want to share this video somewhere on your website and protect it, all you have to do is click Envid Player Code. Uh, you have option to select the player, but I won't be going into how to create it for now because you don't have to use it. And all you have to do is click Copy iframe. Uh, and go to the website and embed this file on your page. Now, if you want to increase the security, 
of that file to allow loading only from uh, your website. So if your website is, for example, google.com and you want to allow loading of that file only on that domain, you can add, uh, dom add allow domains into the domain level protection, enable it, uh, click save changes and the video will only load uh, from your website. Uh, let me show you an example how this looks. Okay, so in here we have set uh, domain tommygames.com to be only allowed to play the video. And when I click preview, you will see video will be working. And now if I go back and remove Tommy Games from the list and say only google.com can show it, of course, you don't have to use Google. This is just for an example. I'm going to try to refresh the page. Protect the access. This file can be viewed only from specific domain, which will basically provide you additional level of security. If somebody finds the links, uh, they will be unable to open them because uh, the content can be loaded only from the website that you have specified. So I hope this solution that we are providing is going to be uh, good enough for your uh, video courses, tutorials, or any way how, or for anything that you want to protect from. So, thank you for your time and join Poblitio.